This film was made by Sid Atkinson in 1946. It features my father, Dick Farnsworth, training a sheepdog and using it um, on his uh, flock of sheep. This is the cottage in Rycroft Glen where he and Sylvia, my mother, lived from when they were married in 1939 until 1951 when they moved to Rycroft Farm. This was one of the earliest uses of colour film after the Second World War. Sid had to have uh, the film sent to America to be processed as there was nowhere in England where you could get it processed at that time. This is Dick going to have a look at a litter of puppies with Billy Vickers at the farm on Tinker's Corner, Bradway. He's looking at each pup very carefully, trying to pick a, a good strong one, and one which he thinks will have the natural ability to make a good sheepdog. When he's selected one, he then leaves it uh, with the mother for seven or eight weeks until it's large enough to uh, take away from its mother. Sid used to like to intersperse his films with uh, little patches of verse. Rudyard Kipling was one of his favourite authors. Now Dick's got the dog and he's taking it back home to the cottage in the Glen. Show it Sylvia and her pet dog Susan. Taking it up in the field for the first time to have a look at the sheep. These are the fields at the cross across at the moss by what's now Whirlow playing fields. Pup's getting its first taste of the sheep. It's wondering what they are. He had a flock of about 40 sheep, which we used to keep across at the moss. He'd bring them to Rycroft Farm in the winter and for lambing. These are the fields below the shed at the moss. You can just make out the big house in the background, the moss house that's now been divided up into flats. At that time it was uh, occupied by the Wilson family. You can see his old dog in the background, keeping a fatherly eye on the sheep while he's training his new dog. Pup's still a bit baffled as to what he's supposed to be doing. One of the first things to get the get the pup to lie down when he's told to lie down.
that's very naughty it's getting a good telling off for that it's getting the hang of keeping the sheep together you don't want the sheep all splitting up if you're trying to drive them keep them all together in a bunch <laughs> 